He's asking. I'm telling. You're going to help us with a heist, or I'm going to rip you out of there and beat you within an inch of your life. <laughs> There's 25 layers of durasteel and cortosis between you and me. We'll both be dead of old age before you make good on that. It's true, we might never get into that safe room of yours, but I'm sure this sonic amplifier I brought will have an interesting effect on the contents. So unless you want to spend your final moments being shaken to death by the dulcet tones of the Kashyyyk Life Day Choir, I would reconsider. <laughs> Sit tight, dretch, and get reacquainted with the concept of hygiene. We've got one more stop to make before we get to the fun part. Punctual, gentlemen. Glad you could make it all this way. No trouble acquiring my little request, I take. <laughs> it's here. You got our money? Of course, friend, but I'd be remiss if I didn't ask to see the goods first. Satisfied. What do we possibly need a missile for? Just the important part, really. You got our money? About that. I was really thinking we should renegotiate the price. You know, seeing as I don't need the whole missile. <laughs> yeah, I thought you might feel that way. Launch sequence initiated. Target acquired. Total atomic dispersal in T minus one minute. You, you son of a. Make it stop! Nah. I could have just killed them. Lex Panache. T minus 55 seconds. Warhead primed. Suffering index set to maximum. You're gonna pay for this! Suckers. Abort sequence aborted. No stopping me now. Yeah, what did she do to this thing? Come on, come on, it's not responding. If I die because you wanted to stiff your dealer, there won't be a Corellian hell far enough to hide you from me. Less threatening, more helping. Tampering detected. Emergency detonation in five seconds. Nice try, jerks. Now, I cannot tell if she did a terrible job rewiring this or too good a one. Three. Oh, so close. Two. I can't wait. One. I didn't... but I thought you were... Oh. Fancy seeing you here. Oh, good, you know each other. Saves me the trouble. Did you get the warhead, or were you too busy practicing your lines? Yes, I got it, Grumpy Pants. Though I guess those lizard brains will have figured out nothing's exploded by now. I'll see if I can't distract them. 
Time to make ourselves scarce. We'll see you back at the hideout. Toodles. If you're still wondering why you're here, it isn't to check out the Tabana gas bars. There's a stealth cruiser loaded with more precious metals than a hut's taste in art hiding down in the lower atmosphere, and it's about to come up for air. And while the Gilded Star is roosting at the Skyhook for its annual resupply, we're going to rob it blind. How do you even know about that? A little bird told us. I speak stool pigeon. Even if you do know where it's going to be, it's got a full military complement on board. And a vault that could survive the ship being reduced to atoms. Most people would consider it impregnable, but we aren't most people, are we, Senya? You do seem to know a lot about our target. Yes, well, I should. Overseeing the Gilded Star was among my duties when I still served Valkorion. Then you are privy to its operational protocols. I doubt they're still the same. You don't have to run the thing. Just get Scorpio to the ship's control center. There's no way we could infiltrate that far into the ship undetected. Oh, maybe, maybe not. But I'm pretty sure High Justice Valen can go wherever she pleases. You're going to have Senya pose as Valen. We've got the best identity doctor this side of the galaxy and as close to a genetic match as we're gonna get. I could never match Valen's gene sequence like that. Although, maybe simulating data corruption in her ID. And create enough doubt to bluff her way through. Dear old mom can manage that, right? Once Valen and her attache droid are on board, they head to the bridge, seize control of the ship, and allow the rest of us to do our parts. Like cracking the vault. It isn't controlled by the network, so I've got to get into the guts of the ship to reach the mechanism. I'll need your help. Meanwhile, Lana and Theron will bridge airlocks with a tanker transport I've secured for the goods. How are we going to carry an entire treasury's worth of loot out of the vault before anyone catches on? Oh, we won't be carrying anything out of the vault. Into, that's another story. Remember how Senya mentioned the vault could withstand everything outside being vaporized? The same applies to what we're setting off inside. The warhead. Exactly. I'll be pulling up the rear with a disintegration bomb. Once it's done its job, we pump the atmosphere into the waiting tanker and make our escape. Because everything up to this point has been so simple. I don't know, running seems pretty straightforward to me. Once that sucker explodes, the crew's going to notice. Everybody's just going to have to hightail it to the transport before they catch on. Now, since we've got less than a day before the Gilded Star rolls into port, I suggest everybody get real familiar with their part. Sorry about the prank earlier. If I'd known you were here, or, you know, alive, I'd have held off. But I finally got him. Same rampant troublemaker, I see. Same grumpy serious face, I see. Still hard to believe you're really here. It's been, what, five years since we went after your old boss? Did you get conked on the head real good? Amnesia, maybe? Locked in a block of carbonite, with nothing but my dreams to pass the time. That's, uh, pretty bad. But better than dead, right? Were the dreams good, at least? Lots of cowering masses and Imperials marching? That's my best guess. Those things are only found in dreams these days. Ah, uh, now that you're back, I'm sure you'll have the whole galaxy quaking in terror in no time. If you thought the Sith were treacherous before... You should have seen it after you and Mar disappeared. I didn't have much reason to stick around once you were gone. So I left them to their infighting before the Eternal Empire rolled in. I... hope you don't mind. As you said, your loyalty was to me. And it still is. Don't count me out yet. I should start warming up for this gig. We'll catch up again soon.